Uki mai anō, welcome back. The search for two men allegedly murdered by a police officer has been narrowed to a remote area south of Sydney. The development comes as police piece together a timeline of events. They've revealed Jesse Baird's phone briefly called police four minutes after neighbours heard shots being fired, but the call quickly disconnected. Australia correspondent Emma Cropper reports. Two hours south of Sydney, police divers scour a rural dam. They don't believe the bodies of Jesse Beard and Luke Davies are still here, but a female friend of the alleged killer cop says they once could have been, because when Beau Lamar drove his hired white van here, she was with him. Did she know that there were two bodies in that vehicle? We believe not, no. Picked up by Lamar on Tuesday, they drove south of Sydney to Bungonia, where he bought two items. An angle grinder and a padlock. Without the passenger knowing why, Lamar drove them to a farm. He used the angle grinder to sever a padlock on a gate. Then... The acquaintance was left at the top of the property for a period of about 30 minutes. He returned and they drove back to Sydney. We don't believe that uh, she was fully aware of what had taken place. But police believe Lamar became suspicious that she did. Cell phone data indicates he drove back that night to move the bodies. We also believe that it's possible the accused has returned to that property and retrieved the bodies and disposed of them somewhere else. Slowing down the investigation. The number one priority at this moment to try and locate um, Jesse and Luke. And that's much harder when the man they believe knows where they are isn't telling them anything. In Sydney, Macropa News Hub.